Hello everybody. Welcome back to Frank Repair Bench. This time I've been given a couple of uh, Commodore 1541 drives to be repaired. So let's begin what seems the worst one. Yes, if I pull this one on, no LED lights, but we can hear the motor spinning so it seems to me that uh, the 5 volt supply is not working so let's open it so I opened it and it was very dust inside so I first of all cleaned blowed out all the dust then what we check first is in this point with the minus lead on the this place we should find 18 to 20 volts but a bit too high but it's okay and here 9 to to 10 volts yes it's a bit too high to 12 most 13 but it's okay for now I know why also and uh, on any TTL chip we should find the 5 volts that's it's 3.9 it's a bit low so there is something shorted I think on the 5 volt rail also the 5 volt regulator gets very hot in a few seconds so there is something shorted on the 5 volt rail and let's see how to find it Okay, remove the main board and looking, uh, this is the ground common, this is the output of the 5 volts regulator and we see only 0 0.2, less than 0 0.2 ohms, so this is uh, quite a dead short somewhere. So unless we want to try to remove everything sitting on the, the 5 volts rail we need to find a way to see or identify the shorter component okay having a good resolution uh, digital multimeter greatly helps finding uh, where is the short so when measuring uh, from uh, the output of the regulator to its ground I was seeing uh, something like uh, 0 0.1 to 0 0.2 ohms but when measuring uh, this particular condenser capacitor I mean that I removed already uh, just put uh, uh, on the other side of the PCB to show what I mean uh, when measuring these two between these two, uh, two points which is the this capacitor I only read 0 0.08 and on everything else on the other components uh, hooked to the 5 volt rail I was reading uh, something more than 0 0.1 0 0.2 0 0.3 and so on so the the last uh, reading was between these two points which is this capacitor and so this capacitor is shorted so I remove it and check it out of secret and it's shorted so let's try to replace this one and see what happens so now it's 5 volts is back to normal let's probe in this point and yes so it's time to hook up a C64 and see if the drive works well. I will try to run this demo because it uses a fast load uh, routine that um, requires a very good aligned and working 1541. So if the demo goes till the end without problems, probably I can declare this 1541 as good. So let's see. Okay, 
split disk. Let's split this. Yeah, worked well. Okay, it was tried to the end without any problem. So of course I tried to save and uh, load programs, which is something you have to do before anything else. So this one is repaired, let's see what happens on the next one. Thank you for watching.